Yo, what is going on everybody? My name is Connor, but you guys can call me Superior. Today, back with another video. Uh, today, this is one of my most requested videos that I've actually ever had since the release of Call of Duty Advanced Warfare. And this is the best class setup for the HBR A3. Now, surprisingly, this is probably the most requested gun to do a class setup with. Now, um, it's definitely not the most used gun in the game versus something like the BAL or the AK-12 or something like that, but the HBR-3 is one of my favorite guns, and from what it sounds like, it's also one of your guys' favorites too. So, the gameplay you guys will be watching to go with this class set of video um, is like a 40... 37 to 40, I don't know, something around there, gun streak with it. I do get a DNA bomb, so it is a really, really awesome game plan. I actually am using the exact same class in the gameplay that I'm going to be talking about in this video. So, um, the class setup should be popping up on your screen right now, and you see right away that I have a lot of perks on it, not a secondary or any grenades or anything like that. And I think when going for a DNA bomb or just 100 plus kills or anything like that, you really don't need a secondary or a grenade because especially in this game grenades really aren't that powerful and won't help you um, you know go on any kill streaks or really kill anyone because uh, with all the exo movements being able to dash and double jump and everything like that it is so easy to avoid a grenade um, that it really won't help you in the long run uh, to have one on versus you could take that off and put on another kill streak or something like that so also there is no secondary on this class and secondaries I really don't find myself using them too much since you can double tap X in this game to to reload even faster uh, you don't really need a secondary as much as you would in any previous Call of Duty so for the attachments I have stock and suppressor stock I like it because uh, I can strafe around you know it makes like jump shotting a lot easier you know you can jump shot while strafing which makes you extremely difficult to shoot so uh, when you combine this class set with something like a scuff or just playing claw or just being really good at hitting the A button it can really help you out a lot so uh, but I do know stock messes up some people's aim so if you want to take off the stock and put on quick draw or something like that you know that uh, is obviously up to you and then the suppressor helps keep you off the radar so if you're going for a DNA bomb or high kill streak or something like that you know that is a huge huge thing uh, perks are pretty basic except in perk 3 I don't have toughness now since this HBR is so freaking accurate you can just take off toughness and still be absolutely fine because this gun has a really high damage um, and it is extremely accurate so um, taking off toughness really won't hurt you that much and the UAV um, the UAV you can really put on the UAV whatever you want um, I do like to have the threat detection on because that's pretty much like a wall hack or an Oracle um, and the assist points help get you towards the system hack and your next UAV and everything like that so having that assist points is almost necessary and is definitely worth the 50 points for because you will easily earn back uh, the 50 points that that you're the extra 50 that it costs to get you that now for the exo ability I have exo overclock because if you're ever stuck in a corner uh, or a tight situation you just need to get out you know you're on a kill streak and you're kind of trapped in a room and you're like okay I need to get out of here as fast as possible you can just click LB Throw on that exo overclock and just dash out of that room as fast as you can. So that is definitely um, a great exo ability. One of my favorite ones to use. So I would definitely put that on. So um, everything else in the class is pretty self-explanatory. You know, camo doesn't matter. Perk 2, there's really only one good perk 2 that uh, I personally use, which is blind eye. Because with so many people uh, being able to get like support sentry guns or stuff like that, that blind eye uh, can be your best friend in this game. So I do hope you guys enjoy this video. Definitely go out and use this class. I promise you guys will like it. It's one of my favorite class setups, and hopefully it can be one of yours too after watching this video. So go ahead and subscribe for more Advanced Warfare content. Leave a like on this video if you did enjoy. Other than that, I hope you guys all have a fantastic rest of the day. I'll see you guys in another video. Peace out.